This is so almost empty, it's weird. So vast. It's weird to think, you know, I'd only be tiny coming here. This is, and my brother saying to me, would you like to come and play? Oh, yeah. He said, we're going to the sand dunes. Oh, fantastic. He tied me up to a pillar and left me there for two and a half hours. That was my brother. Also, you know, being so close to the ocean, it was very imperative we all swam very well. So uh, we were taught to swim very, very early. Um, because, I mean, it doesn't look very welcoming now, but it is, you know. Of course, we never had a surfboard or anything like that. I never heard of those. We didn't even have a canoe, nothing. We were out on the beach all day long. And there was a fearlessness as well, you know. I don't know if today a parent would be happy to let their child all day free. They'd be so worried at times, monitoring. No monitoring, off we were, digging, sand dunes, everything. And I can remember near a Southport, the parties on the beach and somebody coming in and saying, anybody who's got their parents' car had better move it, the tide's in. And there these cars were floating along. Oh, happy days, happy days. Funnily enough, none of my family moved to be near a beach. They all live in Yorkshire. Don't know why. I think it's if you're born near the sea and have been near sand and space like this, you never, ever forget it. It's inside you. Um, I love it.